you're doing these mindset practices you're really like laser focusing your brain in how to get to this result the fastest way possible hello everyone welcome back i hope you're all doing really well today's video is going to be a bit of a life update and story time and kind of like a manifestation story which makes me a little nervous to talk about i know that people can have some strong opinions on it if you're not into it then just skip on by this video but if you want to hear how i achieved my financial goal then just keep watching i wanted to give you a little bit of a background on my history with manifestation or spirituality in my early 20s i spent a lot of time kind of in i think the part of you know the law of attraction and things that people are a little bit iffy about the dream world of it all and not the action of it all and one really cool thing about starting my business is i just really started to grasp the meaning of taking action and taking inspired action having those moments of clarity or like a download if you will and then actually going out and doing that thing instead of just thinking about it a lot of us get really amazing ideas and then we just kind of like shuffle them off like they're not realistic or like it's not actually worth taking action on and I think a lot of opportunity is lost in those moments there has to be something in you that believes that you can actually get to this result otherwise you're not likely to take the action that's actually gonna get you there implemented a lot of like strong mindset practices a lot of which I've shared with you guys in my videos and on Instagram but I'm gonna give you like a full breakdown of the things that I've been practicing and really combine the positivity and the action and some pretty crazy cool results I already journal that's just a part of my practice but specifically I started implementing I am statements and so I would say things like I am kind I am a hard worker I would also talk about my financial goals in like present tense so I was saying I am a whatever your income goal is per month earner as you know I really also love tapping so at the beginning of October I started doing daily tapping videos with Melanie Moore so she's really amazing I also really love Brad Yates so they both have a whole bunch of videos on a ton of different topics but that practice is something that I can like physically feel the shift in myself from being really like anxiety and really lack mentality. I also started keeping track of every single little bit of income that I had coming in. And that's something that Denise Duffield, the author of Get Rich Lucky Bitch, suggests doing is literally writing down every single bit of income you have. So not just like your income from business or from work, but also if you get a discount at the store, like write down your savings. If somebody gives you a gift, write that down so i've been so mindful of just literally celebrating everything if i saved a dollar on my coffee creamer i wrote it down and then i think one of the most important things in kind of shifting my mindset around in a lot of these practices was almost a practice in a certain way of detachment and getting back to just that feeling of having faith and kind of knowing that the universe has your back when you start to take guided action and you just act on the things that you feel called to do and then combining that with faith that everything is going to work out how it's meant to be a lot of times it happens in ways that we don't foresee it happening and so really that part of detachment is like letting go of this grip that we have on how we think things are supposed to happen so even in the tapping work that i was doing is saying even though I don't know how this particular result is going to happen, I'm open to opportunities, I'm open to new ideas, to new ways of thinking and new actions to take that are gonna get me to that particular goal. And so it's really about opening your mind and your brain up to things that maybe you wouldn't have looked at before. And when you're doing these mindset practices, you're really like laser focusing your brain in how to get to this result the fastest way possible. And so to kind of come full circle and actually tell you guys what the hell's been going on, I wasn't seeking this particular outcome, but now that it's here, it makes complete sense and it literally 
close the gap on where I was and where I wanted to be in terms of my income and these particular goals that I had to the dollar. No joke. So I have been obviously grinding away at my business and I've known for a while or been struggling for a while with really wanting to kind of shift the direction that I want my business to go. You guys know that I love my consulting and I've loved that type of like coaching work, but I've been in this stuck place where I'm like, I need all the money that I have coming in in, in order to maintain <laughs> my life and that makes it difficult to focus on the things that at the moment don't make me as much money and have the capital to be able to grow the part of my business that I want. So my mom's business had some turnover happening and so I just had this intuition moment where I was like, I think that I should just reach out and offer to help. I wrote them an email and just said, hey, like I have flexibility in my schedule and these are my different skill sets. If you need some help, I think that I would be a good fit to help you guys. And so I was totally going into it thinking that it's like a support role. And so we sat down, talked about my history, where I was at, what I wanted to do with my business. It just a super open and transparent conversation about my goals. And crazy enough, they actually turned around and offered Offered me a full-time position for a higher salary than I've ever made at any of my other previous jobs three weeks vacation right off the bat and essentially said like you know I really see the value in supporting you to continue to grow your business and to continue working on that like we're supportive of you doing both literally the combination of where I'm at currently with my income combined with what they've offered me I've met my financial goal to the dollar and now I have the capital to be able to focus on growing the education and the coaching and the consulting part of my business that I want to, but at like a comfortable rate. Like there's just so many opportunities that this opens up for me. So it's a lot, like I'm now shifting into being a business owner and a full-time employee. And so that is the major life update. So that's gonna be an adjustment, nothing else. I hope this video kind of brings to light that things really can change for us in a positive way and when we least expect it. And so if you are in a low point in your life, just know that things can change. I'll leave it at that. I feel like this video is getting really long. I hope you're all doing so well and I will see you next week. Bye guys. <laughs>